Whoa, what is happening? Here we are, darling. All right, I can't really show you what I'm wearing right now, but I am getting ready to go live on OnlyFans. And no, I'm not wearing any makeup. And no, I don't care that I'm not wearing any makeup. So anyway. <laughs> mm. All right, so good news is I'm figuring out this Invisalign thing. And I have a lisp right now, obviously, which is like whatever. But I'm not gonna lie, I'm on day three, and those first two days were like hell for me. But uh, since my teeth aren't that bad, I guess my treatment plan is only, um, uh, it's only, I think it's only, oh, it's four months. So it's not bad at all, and I'm very happy about that. So I was like, Lacey, you need to stick this out. It's only four months, so. That's what I'm going to do. Anyways, guys, I pinned a comment. I'm getting ready to go live on OnlyFans. It is free to follow me, so all you have to do is click the link in my bio and follow me for free or go to LaceyK.com. It'll take you there as well. Um, I'm actually going live tonight, and I'm going live tomorrow with two of my friends, Cameron and Ava. So if you guys want to join us, let me know. Um, make sure you head over there and um, check it out. Um, obviously I don't post that much on Instagram. I'm trying to post more, but you guys like Instagram has so many guidelines and it's nice to just kind of hop on and hop off. What I'm really on every single day, um, is OnlyFans and there's no rules on there. I can post, say, and do whatever I want. And that's all my like hot content with all my friends. I don't know how some girls get away with it on um, Instagram. I definitely cannot get away with it. I'm not sure why. Um, I don't know, their discrimination, I don't know, against me, discriminating against me, whatever. So, um, but anyway, uh, you know, it is what it is, but at least there's OnlyFans. So tap my bio, click the link, or go to lacek.com. It says OnlyFans. It's free to follow me there. You guys can see all my content on my feed. Um, you know, we can chat one-on-one. -on -one. Um, I do everything on there. I do like ratings. I do, um, texting. I do like FaceTime calls. I literally respond to every single DM personally. So this is my other phone. Um, anyway, so there's that. <laughs> my manager is texting me. Um, so I have 10 minutes before I go live, 10 minutes. So I just figured you guys might want to join me over there. Uh, no Not November. I'm actually doing a No Not November series on my OnlyFans every single day. I'm labeling it like 1 through 30. And everyone who like gets every single one is getting like a prize at the end of the month. But also, I'm, um, <laughs> I like literally am purposely doing this because I don't want it to be No Not November. I want it to be, you know, the opposite. So anyway, um, <laughs> It definitely works for me too. I'm not going to lie. So anyways, I'm talking funny, but that's just because I'm trying to get used to these whatever Invisalign things. Um, I'm literally trying this because this is like my last shot of like, I'm just going to go for it. And if I don't like my teeth after that, then I'll get veneers. But I know I have nice teeth and I've had a couple dentists say like, do not get veneers. But I just want them to be like, I don't know, like fake looking. <laughs> but anyway, I know my teeth are nice as it is, so whatever. I, la, 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 la. I can't speak. Um, Gigi, get down. Get down, baby. Get down, mama. Get down. Come here. Get down. Get down. Go. Go. Go lay down on your bed. She's always up on my bed, and I just washed it, and it's like, I don't know if any of you guys have dogs, but like, they shed everywhere. <laughs> Why does your mom's teeth fall out? They shouldn't be falling out. That is not normal. My mom actually had um, a doctor do pretty shitty veneers on her two front teeth and they fell out a couple times. And now that she got her teeth redone by Dr. Cam's, they have been completely good in place, not falling out because they're not supposed to, but... Um, you just need to go to a good doctor because that like should not be happening. So if I was to get veneers, then 
I'll let you guys know, of course, because I'm very transparent with everything I do. So I'm actually um, <clears throat> always telling you guys what I do because I'm not ashamed and I don't really care what you guys think. Um, if you're supportive, great. If you're not, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck, fuck. Because uh, <laughs> it's my body and it makes me happy and whatever. So actually, the weird thing is too, like the the older you get, the more you realize like what matters. And also, like, I don't know. You just know that your happiness is a lot more important than what people say about you. Um, because you get one life. And I think kids that are dumb and young and stupid or haters or trolls or whatever don't really understand that. They just want to, like, tear people down on purpose because they feel like shit about themselves. So them making someone else feel shitty somehow for some weird reason makes them feel better. If I accidentally did something to somebody, because of course I've done that in my life, like on accident, or if I've said something that was rude or whatever, I quickly like correct it and then I feel awful for like a long time. Like literally it makes me feel like shit when I'm mean to someone, even if it's like by accident or I'm just having a bad day or whatever and I'm snappy, I'm like, oh my God, I feel like absolute shit. And then I have like a weight like sitting on me, even if, even if I apologize, which I always do, but I still feel like shit. So I don't know how some people could feel good about that. I don't fucking know. That's weird. Anyway, um, but yeah, you got to do what you want to do and, you know, what's right for you. I want to get this robe off and show you what I'm wearing underneath this and then take that off because it's fucking fun, right? Why fucking not? Uh, so make sure you click the link in my IG bio and follow me for free. And, um, you know, you know. Oh, really? Laugh my ass off, get a job. OnlyFans girls are for the street. That's so funny that you say that because my $5 million house that I'm sitting in right now is not from fake money, honey. It's from real money, from modeling and doing my fucking thing. So fucking keep talking shit, bruh. Keep fucking talking shit about we belong to the streets because this $5 million house that I guarantee you are not in right now is not the streets, bruh. <laughs> Suck a dick. Mm -hmm. Right job. Who gives a fuck, dude? Like, the guy who just said that, you know damn well he watches porn, okay? Which is, like, whatever. It's not bad, but what I'm doing is definitely not bad either, and it's not porn. So, you know what? Whatever skeletons are in your closet, buddy, hopefully no one ever exposes you or says shit about you. And the fact that you have to talk shit to a woman who has done nothing to you, a strong, independent woman at that just goes to show how shitty you feel about yourself. So congratulations doing that in front of all 2,300 of these people watching, bruh. Congratulations. You just let everyone know you have a small penis. Because you know why? Only guys with little dicks or little dick syndrome talk shit about other women. Because guys with big dicks and big dick energy bring women up, lift women up, make them feel good, fucking high five them for their accomplishments. So anyway... You lose. Anyways, guys, um, I am going to go on OnlyFans, and I am going to fucking start taking some clothes off and having some fun with you guys. So if you guys want to join me, head over to the link in my bio or go to LaceK.com. It's OnlyFans.com slash Summers, And you know what? We're going to have some fun tonight. And we're going to show that guy that we have fun, okay? So back it. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm going live in one minute. So click my bio, follow me. Right now, it's free.